Welcome to Paja, East Coast Gem of Zanzibar Island. Nestled along the shimmering eastern shores of Zanzibar, a paradise for adventure seekers and relaxation enthusiasts alike, where the azure waters of the Indian Ocean meet pristine white sandy beaches. As the sun casts its warm golden rays upon this tropical haven, a symphony of activities awaits, making Paja a captivating destination for those in search of thrilling experiences. Paja is renowned as a mecca for kite surfers from around the world. The brisk winds and shallow waters create the perfect canvas for kite surfers to dance with the wind and waves. Watch as skilled athletes harness the power of the wind, gliding effortlessly above the water, performing acrobatic maneuvers that defy gravity. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a curious beginner, Taj's kite surfing scene offers an exhilarating adventure. Paja's inviting shores beckon you to indulge in a plethora of beach activities. Sink your toes into the powdery sand as you take leisurely walks along the shoreline, marveling at the breathtaking vistas. Paja is a destination that seamlessly blends adventure and relaxation, making it an idyllic retreat for those seeking the thrill of the ocean and the tranquility of nature's wonders. Whether you're chasing the wind on a kite board or simply basking in the beauty of the island, it's an unforgettable experience that lingers in your heart long after you've left its shores. Stroll along the coastline during low tide and you'll discover a mesmerizing natural phenomenon when beaches transform into a surreal landscape with intricate patterns of seaweed and algae that seem to cover the sand like an underwater forest. Gathering seaweed is a unique and culturally significant practice that has been a part of the local way of life for generations. Here's a closer look at this fascinating phenomenon. In Paja, and along many other coastal areas of Zanzibar, you'll find a thriving industry centered around seaweed farming. Local women, often referred to as seaweed farmers, play a central role in this practice. They step into the shallow waters during low tide where the ocean unveils vast expanses of sandy seabeds. These sandy seabeds are ideal for cultivating various types of seaweed, primarily Yukuma and Kotoni species. Seaweed farming typically involves tying seaweed seedlings to lines or ropes anchored to the ocean floor. These lines are arranged in grids or patterns, allowing the seaweed to grow suspended in the water column. As the seaweed matures, it absorbs nutrients from the ocean. Thriving in the nutrient-rich waters of the Indian Ocean, seaweed is typically harvested after a few weeks to several months of growth, depending on the specific type being cultivated. Local farmers use traditional methods, such as hand-picking the mature seaweed from the lines. The harvested seaweed is then brought ashore for further processing. Seaweed farming in Taja and other coastal areas of Zanzibar is of significant economic importance to the local communities 
It provides livelihoods for many families, especially women who are often the primary seaweed farmers. The harvested seaweed can be sold locally or exported for various purpose. Hello. How are you? How are you, my friends? I'm good. My name is Lucas. My name is Fabio. So I come from, from the Manyara. 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 Mm. Yes, I was coming to here for work. For work. So I back home because all of my family is murdered. Yeah, yeah. That's Manyara. Manyara. So we come here for work and then we back in Manyara to see our family. Yes, I will stay like the two months, three months. And I back the home when I back. But maybe it's better work and I go home. But maybe no, maybe I will stay here. Yeah. It was safe to sell the Spaniards, like the shop. shop. Masai Pole Pole shop. Mm. Yeah, yeah. You welcome, maybe everybody, anyone. You welcome to Pole Pole shop. Says clothes. Tradition Masai. It's tradition Masai. And uh, you look like this also. You know what he counts the shoes, sis? Yes. From the tires, it's motorbike. From mm. motorbike. So, yes. It's my stick, special stick. Sure. It's people must say we have stick. We Masai. have an animal. To because take the care. Ah. To okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. And animal. always have the knife. Okay. Step this the room. Rungu. It's called Rungu. Look this. Mm. Okay. All my side that people have the knife. It's not allowed to the people to have the knife. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so but this is it's like make it from the my father. Okay. So I was served like the forever. I want. We Kakosi. You welcome Pratemoy. You welcome Sandiba. You welcome Tanzania. You welcome Anyara. Everything's okay here. You welcome and beach. <laughs> a large tropical tree in the Ledwood tree family native to Asia, Australia, the Pacific, Madagascar and Seychelles, common names in English, Zandian almond. For tea. Yeah. 
Kiswahili mchai chai. Kiswahili mchai chai. Lemongrass is a widely used herb in tropical countries, especially in Southeast Asia. The essential oil of the plant is used in aromatherapy. And if you see all of the this tree after two cutting, you see pushing you looking at this. I don't know why. And this one, see how you look inside? Oh, there's no water. Yeah. Oh, you see? From in for this. And sometimes this is, this is medicine to treating malaria. Yeah, this. You cutting this and then you you, you heating on the, the cooker and then you you drinking. Yeah. Mm. And inside you have a small like a, a tundra. It's what you call it. Tunda, yeah. If we're eating, maybe you have a guest on the stomach, maybe. Yeah, refresh and then feel good. Mm. Yeah. Lemon, small tree. Mm -hmm. Medicine, this one, see? The treating malaria and the others. This one. So much malaria. Very good. And then maybe you want to wash in your tooth. Yeah. And if we use this to, to wash in your tooth, very nice because he killed all bacteria on there. Yeah. And the truth be strong because this is the level. Yeah, passion fruit. This is very strong, kid. Very strong. Yeah, very strong. And then if you see small like this, you put like this, and then you hit this, and then after, if we big, like uh, stick it to grandfather to you know, you know, yeah. Small like this, and then you put here, and this, and then you put here, and then if you build, you, you, you crow, yeah. <laughs> Name of the tree we call in Cambodia. And this, you see this, this is main, and this is medicine for mainland, very good medicine for woman. Maybe have a pregnant. Maybe he he laid to bone. You take this, you see this, and then you put on the the, the you cooking and then you drinking this one. That is a good medicine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
<laughs> and this is cassava. Cassava. This is cassava. Some people he 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 in Swahili muhogo, muhogo. And this, if we cut in this, kisambu. And uh, to eating for for food and for vegetable. Yeah, mat mbo gausio. Yeah. You cook and then you eating and you gali and this this you cutting. And then you digging the yeah, and then you cooking, you eating and you gali. Yeah, very famous food in Africa.